meet Brad and Jessica. They've been married for a while now, and like many couples, they don't always see eye to eye. They love each other, but conflicts arise and small misunderstandings escalate into what seems like a never-ending back and forth. Soon they're feeling angry, hurt, and resentful. They sit alone and wonder, how did we get here? Welcome to the crazy cycle. We all know that we should love our spouse, but many of us are unaware of the specific needs that God has built into men and women. He created women with a deep longing to feel love. And in men, he put a strong desire for respect. When a husband doesn't feel respected by his wife, he reacts in unloving ways. And when a wife doesn't feel loved, she responds without respect. It's the crazy cycle. Our needs aren't met, so we respond negatively, hoping somehow it will change our spouse for the better. And a loving relationship descends into strife and distrust. Fortunately, God shows us a way to resist this downward spiral. In Ephesians, husbands are commanded to love their wives and wives to respect their husbands. And just as Christ loves us unconditionally, we are to give love and respect at all times, whether we feel our spouse deserves it or not. As we put them first, we begin to recognize that their complaints are often a plea for love or respect. We trust that they are good-willed people, that even in moments of anger or selfishness, they want the marriage to flourish. This is how we end the crazy cycle, with a conscious commitment to love our wives, to respect our husbands no matter what. Brad and Jessica may not always see eye to eye, but they've broken out of the crazy cycle by living in accordance with God's good design.